Dick Vermeil implemented a hardworking approach, so he was an amazing head coach in California. Dick was a jewel. He was a star quarterback at Calistoga High School. <laughs> On wall 176 in Pasadena, California, each player on Dick's team knew his role, so his Bruins upset the undefeated Ohio State Buckeyes in the Rose Bowl. Vermeule used his bag of tricks. He became the head coach of the Philadelphia Eagles in 1976. In 1980, a great guitarist was Eric Clapton. Dick's nephew, Leo Giamona, was Philadelphia's special team's captain. <laughs> Vermeil's Eagles would soar due to their record of 12 and 4. On 111 81 at Veterans Stadium, Vermeil's Eagles experienced many joys because they won the NFC by defeating the Dallas Cowboys. <laughs> Another great coach was Pittsburgh's Chuck Knoll. On 12 18 94 at Veterans Stadium, Vermeil was inducted into the Eagles' honor roll. In 1999, Vermeil's Rams were on a quest. Their 13 wins was a franchise best. In St. Louis, his Rams didn't surf. They led the NFL with 526 points, so they were known as the greatest show on turf. <laughs> on January 30, 2000, at the Georgia Dome, by defeating the Titans, the Rams reached their goal. At the age of 63, Dick became the oldest head coach to win the Super Bowl. Dick designed plays so the Chiefs would score. He won the NFL Alumni's Order of the Leather Helmet Award in 2004. Due to his wonderful work with amateurs and professionals, Vermeil was held in revere. He was named a high school, junior college, NCAA Division I, and an NFL Coach of the Year. In 2006, Dick was adored. He won the Walter Camp Distinguished American Award. Vince Papali's story was told in Invincible, which was groovy. Greg Kinnear played Vermeil in this magnificent movie. Coach Vermeil <laughs> prepared for every game. On November 2nd, 2008, at the, Edward jo at the Edward Jones Dome, he was inducted into the St. Louis Football Ring of Fame. In 2009, in 2009, fans took a look at Gordon Forbes' book. Due to their Super Bowl win, the St. Louis Rams would achieve, read, Dick Vermeil, whistle in his mouth, heart on his sleeve. Coach Vermeil concentrated every down. In 2011, he appeared in the greening of Whitney Brown. <laughs> That's what in, we're going right now. In Chester County, Pennsylvania, Dick doesn't have any doubts. His annual celebrity golf tournament raises money for their Boy Scouts. Vermeil wants every kid to earn a high school diploma. In Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, there's a stake named after him at Villa de Roma. <laughs> Professors work in academia. Dick supports the Eagles fly for leukemia. Dick effectively coached many stars. Calistoga, Calistoga California features race cars. Dick's dad worked hard every day. The Louis, the Louis Vermeil Classic occurs at the Calistoga Speedway. Star Trek featured a legend named Captain Kirk. Dick Vermeil became a coaching legend due to his hard work. <laughs> Yay! Well done, well done. Did you like the poem? Yeah, that's great. Thank you. This is for you to keep. Thank you. Well, that was something. That's